hello and welcome to this video my name is Jahin and in this video I will show you how to add gradient button or background color inside system.io so if you are using system.io and if you are a beginner in system.io then I will highly suggest you to uh, go to my channel and check this beginner tutorial uh, this beginner tutorial which I will put in the card and in the background as well so if you are a beginner if you go through this tutorial you will understand everything about system.io and also you will get some bonuses as well so if you already have using system.io then you know what the editor is and how to get into this editor so let's talk about about system.io gradient button or background and the main thing about custom css inside system.io and how it works and how you should think about the custom css thing so first of all you need to have some gradient color right so in i will put the link in the description this is a gradient generator website you can go to this website and generate some gradient color so we need some code css code okay so these are the css code for gradient color so let me explain how to use it inside system.io so suppose you wanted to give this whole section okay this whole section a gradient color so let me take a new section under this one and let me take a heading here so I want to give this section so if I click on this section and if I scroll down I can give a background color right this is the background color and what is the inner background color if I give another color you can see inner background means the row the background for the row you can see this is the row and this is the section so if I want to give this section a gradient color i will just remove the inner background color you won't find any option here because these are the solid colors that we can give inside th this area and also we can add background image but there is no option to add gradient color so how to do that so if you click on this section and if you scroll down you will find that in each design and each section or row system.io provide a unique id which is related to some coding things to do so i'll explain how to use it so first of all we need to copy this and then you need to just remove your background color from this area to transfer it okay then what we need to do we need to scroll back there and then i will just come to this and take a raw html here okay this raw html here and then click on this and go to edit code click on the raw html and then click on edit code then we need to paste some code for a pasting these codes what i will suggest i will suggest the, this style uh, this uh, css editor as well because sometimes system.io editor do some typos so you need to put style just like this it should be close and ended and then you need to put the id here so this is the id and before the id you need to put a hash okay so uh, let me close it so this id will be different for each of us but we need to come to this style and paste the style i'll put the link in the description copy code of the description as well and then you have to give a hash before the id so have to find the id we need to go to the section we need to go to the section and go to the below of the section and copy this one okay it will be different for each of us so this is not the same id it, may, it will look different for you so you need to put the id and a hash before the id because id need a hash in coding okay in html and then some curly bracket second bracket or curly braces it should be open and closed just like this and in between these we need to paste the code so let me paste this code here so from this from any anything any code that you have and then paste it here now the code has been pasted now copy all the code i will copy all the code from here and then go back to the system.io editor and click the raw html and click on edit code then what i will do i'll click ctrl a to select all and backspace to delete and then paste it okay so it has been pasted now click on save and after clicking the save now you can see that our section has already taken a gradient color so this how you can make any section any row a gradient color by defining the id of this html okay so you can find a id for this section as well if you go to this section and if you scroll down you will find the unique id for that as well you need to copy that and go to a css editor is open it close it put a hash before it and paste the 
code in between those brackets. Now let me talk about how to put this for a button. So for button, if you click on this button and if you scroll down, you will find that this button has a background color, right? So I'll remove the background color first. Then I'll scroll down and I'll find a same type of ID attribute, a unique ID for the button. So I'll just copy it. Okay, I'll just copy it. Go back to the CSS editor. I will not put the code in the system.io editor because sometimes it do some mistakes. So I'll just put enter and put a hash and paste the code here for the button. Then I'll put bracket, open it and close it. And then I'll move my cursor here, put some space and then click some enter. Okay, then I <coughs> then we'll put the gradient color in between those brackets okay it could be any color code i am just using the same color code okay then what i will do i'll just again copy all the code from here and go back to system.io and come to this html element raw html element click on edit code and then control a backspace to delete all and control v to click save and one things uh, to notice here if i click on save changes one thing you will see that it is not reflecting in the editor but if i click save changes and click on preview in the live editor you can see that it is showing so there is some issue with system.io editor so this how to add a gradient color and gradient button using system.io hope that helps if that helps do smash that like button and if you have any other question let me know in the comment as well so thank you very much for watching the video